What's up YouTube? This is Manuel and welcome to another video of Lifestyles and Sneakers. Today we have another Yeezy unboxing and this time it's gonna be the Adidas Yeezy Boost 350V2 in a scent colorway. So stick around! If you're new here to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, let me give you some reasons why you should be subscribing now. Number one, we feature a lot of cool sneakers. Number two, we visit a lot of dope sneaker shops and outlets. And number three, we have amazing giveaways such as these. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe now! So guys, we have another easy unboxing and I think you know what it is so uh, let's jump right into it. 3, 2, 1, BANG! The Adidas Yeezy Boost 350 V2 in a scent colorway. Initially, I didn't really like this colorway because I thought it was almost the same as the clays. However, now that I have it on hand, it's really, really nice. In fact, for me, I think this is the best colorway amongst these uh, three regional exclusives. I mean, the landmark for me is, is similar to the statics that was released last December. And the uh, Antlias are like uh, faded frozen yellows. But this one, yeah, it's really, really different. This is the first time Yeezy is releasing a predominantly pink colorway. So now let's have a closer look. Of, so on the upper, you have your typical Yeezy 350 V2 prime knit. The design of the prime knit is similar to the statics that was originally released last December, as I mentioned earlier. And the color of the prime knit is predominantly light pink with hints of gray. The laces of the sneakers is also trim reflective and the color is the same as the prime knit. Moving down the sneakers, you have your typical 350 V2 rib midsole. And on your outsole, you have your exposed boost on the heel and on the forefoot. The significant feature of these sneakers is actually the pull tab, which you won't see because there's nothing. There's no pull tab on these sneakers. Actually, this is one of the few DC350 V2s or DC350s that doesn't have the pull tab which is actually a bit weird because um, we got used to all the 350 V2s having the pull tabs. Although, now that I'm holding it and looking at it real close, um, yeah, I mean, it, it, it's okay. It's okay, it just feels weird. But um, yeah, it doesn't look bad at all. So I think now it's time to lace this up and show you how it looked on feet. like how these bad boys look on feet well definitely it's nice because it's another 350 v2 the colorway is quite different from the usual 350 v2 although since the colors are very very subtle it gives you a similar look and feel like the other 350 v2s now would i recommend these stickers well if you haven't had a 350 v2 and you have a chance to get this then definitely get this pair because it's really nice I honestly believe that this is the best colorway amongst all the three regional releases and we've been so lucky because uh, the Asia releases have been really nice like the hyperspace and now this one so yeah I mean if you can get this pair then definitely get it now what I didn't mention is that today they're also releasing the 
3M reflective version of these sneakers, which unfortunately I wasn't able to get a pair in retail. However, I will try my best to get a good deal so that I could also show you the 3M reflective version of the scent. That's about it guys. So if you like this video, please press the thumbs up button down below. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please smash the subscribe button. Don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Until next time.